Hi there, my name is Laura Waldman and I'm the Abundance Activator and today I want to speak about a very important money block that comes up for a lot of the women that I support and work with and it was something that also came up for me and that is playing it small. So, have you been playing it small? Have you been putting a lid on yourself? Have you been shrinking yourself, trying to squeeze in to a very uncomfortable box that you've been trying to live in. Now I hope even with that question you'll know if you're doing this or not. But how do you know? You might feel like you're too much, you're too big, you're too loud, you're too much energy. Uh, this is definitely something that I struggled with, which was I was too powerful, too strong, too much. So I really, for most of my life, squashed my energy. And this resulted in big emotional imbalances, outbursts of anger, but also physical health problems as well, such as candida and IBS. I held it all in my belly. And part of my journey on my abundance activation journey, connecting to my purpose, but getting more into the flow of receiving especially when it came to money, was about me needing to fully show up and share the truth of who I am with the world. And I tell you what, this is probably like one of the scariest things I was asked to do on this journey thus far. But it was essential. And it's also essential for you too. And especially as women, we're given a lot of unconscious messaging that it's not okay to be too strong. It's not okay to be too powerful. It's, you know, it's not okay. People won't like you. People won't love you. You won't be considered attractive. Or what I see with some women as well is that they're scared that if they're too happy, too rich, too successful, too healthy, too wealthy, that people won't like them. They'll be on the receiving end of judgment or other people's, you know, hate. There's a fear of loss of love or a fear of rejection. And this is a common theme that I see over and over again. So if this is sounding familiar or ringing a bell, it's really, really essential for your health, if for nothing else, that you start to lift a lid on all the ways that you're squashing and squishing yourself, or you're hiding yourself, or you're holding yourself back and limiting yourself. Because there's a part of you that is just ready to burst out, to realize your full potential in the world. And how I see that as a healer, as a, a psychic and a channel, it's, it's your soul, it's your higher self, it's your purpose that wants to be realized, it's designed to be realized in this physical reality. And there's a part of you that's come here to share this with the world, and there's another part of you that is clamped down on the truth of who you truly are, because it hasn't felt safe, or it hasn't felt acceptable, or it hasn't felt allowed. For me, I never received recognition for who I was. No one ever really acknowledged me for me, that I was valuable for, for who I am just by being. So, and you know, that's no one's fault. No one did that for my parents and those people, no one did that for those people. And we're all kind of suffering from not being fully seen, from not being valued, from not being recognized. So it is now my passion to do that for you. It is my passion to see you for who you truly are, to give you permission to be all of you, the wild, the powerful, you know, maybe even the kind of unreasonable and emotional and intense version of you, that you, the wildly successful and beautiful and gorgeous and attractive and amazing side of you. Bring it on, because that is super exciting for me. So you gotta hang out with the right people. <laughs> gonna welcome who you truly are and celebrate in who you truly are. Not everyone can handle it, and that's okay, that's their crap, but I want to give you permission, at least when you hang out with me, to really show up as you and really celebrate who you are. That's what the world needs. We need empowered women. We need empowered people walking through the streets, because you've got something to share. You've got something to gift to the world that is for you, for your own fulfillment, for your own happiness and peace, but it's also here to contribute to the planet in your own unique way. It can be in a smaller way or in a bigger way. And I know that that has got to come out, just if, if for nothing else, for your mental health, for your physical health. So what's really fascinating about this is this hiding yourself, shrinking yourself, limiting yourself, squashing and squishing yourself into a tiny little space, 
really can affect your flow of abundance. It can affect your finances. So one of the great news is when you actually lift the lid on who you are and share more of who you are with the world, magic happens. You're much more open to receive as you share more of your truth with the world. It's pretty friggin' cool. So if this is resonating with you and you'd like to find out more, please feel free to contact me. This is one of my greatest passions is to kind of birth you into the world, welcome you here. It is so essential for yourself and the world that you do. So sending you lots of love. If for nothing else, I give you full permission to be you, your powerful, wild, wonderful woman self to go out and shine and share this with the world no matter what, even if people don't like it, even if you get judgment, do it for you and do it for those people that are really calling for you, who need it. <laughs> so sending you lots of love for now and speak to you again very soon.